Hey watch lovers, Brad from Brent Miller Jewelers. And today I have for us two 41 millimeter Black Bay models. On my left is the newer, most recently introduced monochrome on the three link bracelet. And on my right is last year's release. Uh, this was the updated 41, the first time they kind of thinned it out a little bit, gave it a slightly smaller proportion, uh, lug to lug, uh, but kept that same lovely burgundy red bezel on it. And I noticed I still have this one in stock. So while I have it, I thought I'd throw these side by side. I have the five link in the burgundy as well. I did not have the five link or I would have grabbed both of them. Um, did not have the five link on the monochrome, but this one currently available. But I really just wanted to put them side by side and ask you, if you were in the market for a 41 millimeter black bay, would you go black or would you go red on the bezel? And do you like these? If you've seen them, if you've gotten to try them on, do you like them more than the prior generations that are a little bit more slab sided? A little bit thicker and a little bit longer lug to lug. Obviously, if you're not familiar too, you are getting the Metas movement. Um, so the master chronometer movement uh, on these updated models. So uh, let me throw these both on wrist. I'm not going to go over the specs in this video. I've done enough uh, videos here with this model. I will list them in the description if you're looking for the specs. Um, both of them, 4425 on the three link bracelets. So again, here it is on my six and three quarter inch wrist. And I know some folks have been saying that the reflections from my ring light, again, my lighting in here is not great, so I'll try to give you some. I'm in a back office. Just try to give you some without that ring light with the glare. I'll put it back on here as I put the burgundy model on. For me, if you're going to own one watch and one watch only or have a very small collection, the black seems to make sense. Unless red's your favorite color and you wear a lot of red, uh, then you want to color color match that to some clothing. Um, but if you had a larger collection and you've got your black watch covered, I think I definitely would go with red. Uh, you don't see a lot of uh, red watches, red dial watches, or even red bezel watches. And uh, I am a fan of that shade of uh, burgundy red. And I like the gilt markers as well. So again, can't go wrong with each. Just depends where you're at in your collecting journey. But I uh, thought I had both. I'd do a quick side-by-side -side and ask you which one you would be wearing uh, if you had the choice. So as always, thanks for viewing. If there's anything I can do for you, shoot me an email, brad at brentlmiller.com. I'm going to keep this video quick today, and uh, we'll see you in the next one.